All right, there's our loaf coming out of the oven. I still haven't worked out all the cool kinks with this camera, but the fact that I can go HD and do so many different things with these cameras, I don't even know how to use all the stuff on a manual camera. I just got a camera and went for it. I'm gonna put it back in to brown the bottom up a little bit, but that's about the size I wanted too, because what I can do with this, this is how big it is, all right? I got pretty big hands, here's the chef blade. This is a eight inch, okay? All right, so I can cut this into pieces like that big and that big, and then cut it in half and make a good sandwich. Um, a sandwich doesn't have to be square like that. It can be that size. It can be long like that. If I cut it all the way, I can make a huge sandwich. Or I could use the ends or, you know, but I like to, I like my sandwiches small. A lot of the portions of the food that I eat, you'd be surprised. I, I have all this beautiful food, right? Sometimes with like a pasta or a, excuse me. Medications, man. I will tell you this, in all honesty, okay, as an addict, ex-addict, user of many drugs, and except for like heroin and a few other things, heroin makes me deathly ill, but all these medications that I'm on from the doctor do worse stuff to my system than a medical marijuana does. And the three of them combined that I have, if I overdo any of them, it's really bad. And I have one, I, I, I was doing twice as much for a while because I wasn't getting all my, I wasn't getting my weed, man. One, no, not just weed. We have medical marijuana here and they've got strains and special strains for guys with PTSD, guys who like it slows your head down and refocus you. Um, we've got stuff that, like, if you're down and low, it'll get your head up. If you need stuff to calm your head down, I mean, it's really amazing. And what the really cool stuff is, I've introduced the elderly people, my friends who have aches and pains and hands that don't hurt, okay? And, man, lots of people in their 50s and 60s and 70s have hands that don't hurt and don't work. Not like they used to at all. And they're always suffering. And he put this cream on. Comes out of a can. Comes from uh, just like, you know, uh, just like you went to the store and got it from the pharmacist, man. That's what it's like. You got it from this company and it has these special CBNs and CB oils in it. No THC whatsoever. None. Nothing that makes you high. Just stuff, stuff that heals you. And it's in this little squirt can, just like lotion. You rub it on, and the guy said it's the best thing you ever had. Several people put it on, and they're like, I can't, I've tried everything. Everything from Icy Hot, from doctor stuff, to ibuprofen, to stretching, to this. And I put this on, and I'm like, you know, it wants me, to, my hands want to be more active. I put it on my back, too. Anyways, bread's done. I'm, what I'm doing right now is I like to put a little bit of a crust in the bottom, and then I'll pull it back out, let it cool, and give her a cut. Look, I'm going to talk about the realities of, like, you know, I keep it real. I try to keep it real, man. If you don't, then you just front when you come to the table. You know? If I come up here and be like, hi, I'm a billionaire. I want to see if you have what it takes. Don't front. Front, front. <laughs> Where's the rabbit? <laughs> I don't know if I'm going to hit him started. My head still hurts, man. I was pressing wrong.